Hey guys, so uh, thanks for joining. I am setting up some artwork for the show at Confluent. It's based on uh, it's based on mental illness and uh, it's titled Invisible. So I'll give you more. I'm gonna come to the reception only for a little bit so you don't see the whole thing, but I'll come to the VIP event and then the reception as well and My pieces, as you, as you may know, were in response to Italy. Uh, two of them are boats uh, and have text in them as well. And then two of them are uh, bombs, like Molotov cocktail bombs, which there's stories behind that, but also it's uh, the response to a lot of the refugee stuff that's going on. And it's not super org, like it's not, a lot of my work has very direct stories and it's kind of like obvious what's going on. This this body of work, or these, these pieces are less, uh, I'm not explaining it as much as uh, as I, I usually do. I'm still playing with ideas. I'm still mixing ideas. I'm still working on the concept and the development of the pieces. So I will be back for the reception. I just hung up the pieces. I'll show you guys what they look like when I come back. And I will see y'all later. up at the Confluent Space. I've done a video in the past from their opening a long time ago. Uh, I just finished up there for the show, the art show on mental health. I have four pieces in it. Um, they're all new and they're super in progress. I'm having a terrible time like explaining them and articulating what uh, is going on in them. So that's fun, but it was still good. Uh, it was fun to do a show because I haven't been doing as much artwork as you guys know with all the new new life stuff new new kiddos so uh my four pieces were in response to the stuff in italy like, and i don't know how i want to respond i'm still trying to figure it all out you guys um i know that i want to talk about the the crisis i want to talk about how big it is i want to talk about how many people are affected i want to talk about their experiences i want to talk about the emotions talking to them. I want to talk about my background in mental health stuff and the emotions like I experienced while I was there. I want to talk about like all the stories. I want to talk about my stories, and how they relate. I want to talk about how like my stories relate, but they're not, they don't even compare at the same time. Like there's so much that I want to talk about and I feel like I'm really struggling to get that out. And so that's on um, these pieces. Uh, several people, like, it was really cool to hear people talking about them because there were People had really great feedback just listening to it. And so I overheard a few conversations, which was really helpful. And this this lock has been sticking out. I've put it, oh my gosh, sorry. Um, yeah, so it was really good to see that feedback and uh, listen to what people had to say. Um, yeah, I guess I don't know what else to actually, to really say, but there's just so much. But the pieces I have, so all... Um, I didn't get any good pictures of them today, but the pieces in the show are boat pieces. I hope I have some good pictures to insert here. Uh, one of them might actually sell. We'll see. But, um, but, uh, so I did four. Two of them were boat collages and two of them were cock Molotov cocktail bombs and called bomb collage. I don't have names for them yet, you guys. I don't name a lot of my collages. I just do them. But, uh, but yeah, so the... The boats came from just the massive number of refugees and boats that are crossing from Libya and with the people into um, just the massive number of boats from Libya into Catania into into Sicily, the island, uh, 
that's like the ball below the boot that's being kicked in Italy. Y'all know what I mean. <laughs> uh, and so it's just, it's crazy the situation. And so the boats were from uh, Pozzolo. The, I, I have another video for Pozzolo and 